150 million dollars of jewelry was once in possession of Princess Diana. Princess Diana, known for many as the People's Princess, has fascinated and influenced the world even long after her passing. Today we're talking five epic royal jewels that Diana wore like no other royal. My name is Ana Lucia Beltran and I'm a jewelry designer and diamond expert. I invite you to like this video and subscribe as I bring you everything you've always wanted to know about the diamond and jewelry world. Now let's dive in into Princess Diana, most epic royal jewels. Number one, the Spencer tiara. The price tag on this tiara is an estimated $470,000. This piece became famous when Diana wore it to her wedding to Prince Charles in 1981, a royal union watched by over 750 million people in over 74 countries. The design consisted of stylized diamond flowers with a center heart shape, and it was artfully crafted by House of Gary in 1930 and commissioned by Diana's family. Before Diana wore this tiara to her wedding, her two sisters wore it to her respective weddings, making this tiara a true family heirloom. Number two, the sapphire, diamond, and pearl choker necklace. $120 million is what this piece could be sold for today according to jewelry experts' estimations, making this necklace probably one of the most expensive pieces of the entire royal jewelry collection. Now, this piece wasn't always a necklace. This spectacular 65-carat oval-cut blue sapphire surrounded by 7.71 carats of diamonds was originally a brooch. Given to Diana by the Queen Mother as a wedding gift, Diana later transformed into a choker by adding over 20 carats of pearls. Lady D wore this $100 million necklace while dancing to John Travolta at the White House in 1985. And also right after Prince Charles admitted on national television he was cheating on Diana. Well, there were three of us in this marriage, so it was a bit crowded. Yes, absolutely. She combined this necklace with the so famous revenge dress. If you're wondering about the jewelry that I'm wearing right now, click on the link below to discover my original diamond designs. Number three, the controversial sapphire engagement ring. Prince Charles proposed to Diana with a stunning $60,000 12 karat oval shape blue silon sapphire surrounded by 14 brilliant diamonds in an 18 karat white gold setting ring. Now, silon sapphire comes from one place, Sri Lanka, and is one of the most exquisite quality sapphires. But why was this ring controversial at the time? Diana was actually the one who chose this ring from an existing jewelry catalog from the House of Garrett, instead of having it custom made, which was royal tradition. It is said this truly upset Her Majesty the Queen, who realized that anyone who could pay the $60,000 at the time could own the same ring of the future Queen of England. These days, the ring belongs to Catherine, Duchess of Cambridge. The ring has been one of the most replicated jewelry pieces of all times. Number four, the Emerald Choker. This piece is estimated to be worth about $17 million. It was originally a necklace that featured 14 emeralds in cabochon cut and originally belonged to King Mary. And in 1920, it was redesigned by House of Garrett and turned into a gorgeous choker. Diana made headlines in 1985 during a tour to Australia when she actually wore this exclusive choker as a headband. And this is one of the many reasons why Diana is my top royal to ever worn jewelry. Period. Today, the choker remains in the royal collection and actually no one is allowed to wear it. Number five, the lover's knot tiara. This glamorous tiara has an estimated value of $2.3 million. It dates from 1914 and it was created for Queen Mary and it was inspired by the original Cambridge lover's knot tiara. It featured 19 diamond arches, each one of them with a dangling pearl, and of course, covered in diamonds. The most iconic moment in which Diana wore this tiara? It has to be the Elvis look during a Hong Kong tour in 1989. Truly mesmerizing. Today, this iconic tiara is worn by Catherine, Duchess of Cambridge, and in my opinion, she wears it beautifully. Yet I must say, no one will ever wear it like Diana. So which one of all these royal jewels would you have in your possession? Tell me all about it on the comments below. My personal favorite, it has to be the Lover's Knot Tiara. Truly breathtaking. Until next time, keep shining bright.